Howdy, 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 and welcome to my channel, Dan Nguyen the Snortcast. And this is my first video here talking about my work, about my comedy, and my community around me who make me laugh. And the Snortcast is my new live interview show where I'll be interviewing funny people all around the world finding out what makes them laugh, how they got into comedy, and why comedy is so important when we go through the dark times. And before I launch into who I am, please follow on the links uh, on my Facebook and Instagram, and also click on my link for my website where you'll get all the interviews and more information about the Snortcast, about the Snortcast. So yes, my name is Diana Nguyen. I am an actor, comedian, and an creative entrepreneur. And what does that all mean? Well, I need to go back to the basics of my story, uh, how I became who I am. So I am Australian Vietnamese, and my mother came to Australia as a refugee from the Vietnam War. And I have always loved the arts because my mother gave me the greatest gift of all, which was to perform when I was such a young child. I had my first piano at three years old. I learned ballet at seven and music karaoke has been part of my life up to the age of 16 when my mom decided, no, you can't do these arts anymore. You've got to go and concentrate on the top five subjects, which is all the science and all the high math stuff. And because <laughs> Because the art has been in my life for so long, uh, I kind of deflected my mother's expectations and just kind of steamrolled into where I am now. So I've been an actor and comedian for 15 years working here in Australia, working in theatre, TV and film. I'm also a, a creator of my own work, so I produce my own work. Because as we know, I am creating more visibility for myself. And it's taken me a really long time. Like I've been trying to create YouTube videos and trying to be funny and trying to understand YouTube. But all I do know is that I know who I am and I know what I want to do. And that is to keep working in this field that I love so much, so much. And I'm really excited. I'm really excited to play. I'm really excited to just go and launch off and just explore the possibilities. Because when I discovered that I was a creative entrepreneur two years ago on a platform called LinkedIn, it blew my mind because it meant I could tell my story. And you're going, why LinkedIn? What the hell are you talking about? Yes, I know, LinkedIn. I've been a LinkedIn content creator for two and a half years creating content and talking about my story, about my personal brand, about why I'm an artist and how it is like to be an artist. And I think that's what's missing. Um, that was what was missing on LinkedIn. And I think that's also missing here on YouTube. Um, we're so good at seeing the finished product. And I really want to show the creative process of what it's like to be a creative not just the finished product of doing stand up or writing a book or making a web series. And on that, I'm also a, uh, a web series creator. I'm a co-creator of Fee and Me TV, and I'll talk more about all the little aspects of my life. <laughs> and you might have noticed that I love the color yellow. Um, yellow has been epic. Uh, is my favorite color in the world because it's light and I found out what yellow also means. It also means being optimistic. And when I see yellow, I am bloody optimistic. I'm optimistic about everything possible, except when I have depression. And I'm learning what that means, depression, and how I kind of dug myself into the whole of depression and I'm learning that when I see depression coming into my life, because it comes, it creeps in, right? It's just like, woo, we're coming, we're creeping in. And I, it's been a process for me for the last 15 years. Oh, for really, like I feel like I had depression when I was a kid, has been to, yeah, to cut it. 
before it soaks into me and controls my emotions and my mood and my uh, my movement because yeah depression does suck you in and I'm learning to not let it suck me in so yellow is my color <laughs> and yes I am a snorter um, and it Oh, all these things are all coming and bouncing all over each other because um, the reason why I snort is that you, I don't breathe very well. So when you hear someone snort, it's because they suck their air in and it goes up the nose and the, that sound comes out. So if you're breathing and you're ha 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 ha, you're breathing properly, but when you're snorting, you're not breathing. So I am a habitual snorter and it took me a really long time to realize that um yeah i don't breathe but i am a snorter and i love snorting i love big laughter i am a big laughter person i uh, people say when they see me laugh they see my whole body laugh and i think it's really important to be a hundred percent in most things that you do i've been learning i've been learning i've also got a coach and she said you can't be absolute which is true I am 99% <laughs> of laughter and joy and greatness. And so, you know, when I talked about depression, I go 100% as well. So I'm very passionate and I love life and I love traveling. And, you know, this video is so scattered all over the place because I want you to meet me. I am, I am stubborn and random and spontaneous and I believe in love and it's, one of the things that I, oh man, yeah, <sighs> Ugh. I'm 35 years old, I look amazing and I feel great, I live a very fulfilled life, um, but I am struggling with love. And that's been my process for the last 12 months has, to be, has been to understand what love is and that it isn't attaching myself to loving someone, but it's actually to love me. And I'm coming to this point where I would love, I would love to share my stories, my emotions, my joys, my hate. <laughs> for things in my life with someone. And I, I'm really into building right now that part of my life. Like I have really worked hard in building my career. <sighs> and it's freaking lonely. <laughs> it is lonely to build by yourself. And as any entrepreneur that is very lonely and slow, and as a creative entrepreneur, um, it's hard. So this YouTube video is about everything that I'm trying to discover about myself. And with the Snortcast interviews that I'm doing, it is to share other people's joys and their worlds to you. I really believe that with less ignorance and discrimination that we do have a kind world and i'm looking forward to sharing these wonderful people in my life that have shared love and joy through their stories and this is why this youtube new page for me is so important because i want to articulate that i want to share that world with you Ah, and hopefully I find a husband. <laughs> so, uh, I am here. I am looking forward to updating regularly here to keep this story alive. Dada to win the Snortcast. And I can't wait to show you the journey of what it's like to be a creative entrepreneur, an actor, a comedian, a a lover to you um, because I think there's so much to learn and so much 
oh, I, I, yeah, I just embrace community and family and I can't wait to share this story with you and see what happens. <laughs> so join me on the links below to my Instagram at the snortcast or being Diana, which is my personal account. And also check out all the other links as well that's in the bio below. I look forward to snorting with you, keeping it snorting real. <laughs>